Well, good morning. My name is Millie Boots, and I don't know what part of the camera to look into, so I'm going to look off into the distance like a nostalgic flower. Now, all the time, even though this is my very first video, people ask me, how do I get my style? Well, I'm going to walk y'all through it. Don't, don't worry. I'm, you can look just like me. I don't know, what do you want me to look at you or do you want me to look at the camera? Well, what part of that? I don't even know what, where's the eyeball? First of all, we're gonna start with the hair. I just woke up, so my hair's in a ball. Um, you're gonna always want to start fresh out of the bed for this look. Now, what you're gonna wanna do is go on down to Walmart and get you a $6 brush. It's gonna look like this, except it's gonna have a handle, uh, and it normally doesn't have an animal living in it. Just, that's gross. Next, you're gonna brush your hair. Just brush the, brush the, sh brush your, brush your hair. Brush it, brush it, it's real important. Just brush the shit out of your hair. Now, assuming you just woke up like me, you still have your makeup on from the night before. So that's perfect. We're not gonna take it off. We're gonna use it as a primer. Oh, back up. Moisturizer. Moisturizer is really important. Like su super important. What you're gonna do is you're gonna go on down to Walmart. You're gonna get you a coconut oil. Next, you're gonna take a wooden spatula that you found in that a cabinet that you don't use because you don't cook and then we're just gonna just dig in you gotta get a lot of it you're you're wrinkly you need a lot of this now you're gonna take it and you're gonna put it on your six dollar hairbrush that you got from Walmart just gonna lather it on there there you go now this is a life hack you probably never thought of it but it is genius. I have seen multiple celebrities that I know, because I know a lot of them, like Britney Spears, me and her, we're just friends. And I call her Brit Brit. Anyway, that's a good amount right there. Now you're gonna take it and you're just gonna brush your face. Get it in there, hit up all those wrinkles, just perfect. Moisturizer is super important. Next, eyebrows. Now, perfectly manicured eyebrows are in. So, what you're going to want to do is go on down to Walmart and get you a $6 hairbrush and I don't remember how much this stuff costs, so get some of it. And then, we're going to just brush, just brush the crap out of your brush these babies right here until they look, don't look like caterpillars anymore. There we go. Oh, <laughs> yes. Next, your lips. Your lips are the eyes to your face. What you're gonna do is you're gonna go on down to Walmart. You're gonna get you some organic cranberry juice and you're just gonna rub it on your lips. Forget that crap. What you're gonna do is you're gonna go and pull out that bag that you have that your grandma gave you a long time ago that has all those freebies from Clinique and Estee Lauder and Target and you're gonna get that lipstick and you're just gonna take that and you're just gonna make sure it's this, um, this is Vivid Berry. So get that color, even though this is from 1999. Now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna just, don't worry about it, just get it on there, slap it, slap it. You wanna go a little bit outside the lines. You know, don't go too crazy, but get it. Look, it's not, don't worry about it. We're gonna blend it, it's gonna look great, it's gonna be fine. Just go outside the lines. You got little chicken lips, you wanna, you wanna have big old Who's that girl that did that cup thing? Well, you don't have to do the cup thing. You can just do this. 
big lips. I'm gonna blend it in, shut up. Next, contouring. Contouring is super important. You cannot skimp out on the contouring. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get this color. Pretty sure I got it for free from my grandma. And pretty sure it's not for my race, but I'm gonna use it for contouring. All right, you got some of the contour stuff on your brush. You're gonna take it and you're just gonna do this. Don't worry about it. We're gonna blend it in. It's gonna look great. You know, sometimes I do a little trick, a little life hack. Let me show it to you. <laughs> Here's the trick. If you just really want to get that perfect contour, you're going to take a boot like this and you're just going to use it to line very gently. And then we're going to go like this, actually like this, and we're just going to perfect. That's probably not sanitary. I was done contouring, but we're just not yet. You gotta go right here. I watched a tutorial. Right here. Don't worry about it, we're gonna blend it in. It's gonna look great. We wanna go right here too. And we wanna just color in your beard too. You wanna make, make it look like you got a big old lady beard. Don't worry about it, we're gonna smooth it all in and it's gonna look great. Next, we're gonna do highlights. So, we're gonna take this stuff, I'm pretty sure it's called stripper glitter and I think it's eyeshadow. We're gonna use it for highlights because it's all I got and we're just gonna Just, you know, just dab it right there. Why not? Why not put some right there? And then just don't worry about it. We're gonna blend it in. It's gonna look great. Now, cat eyes are super important. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna get you a magic marker. You don't, don't say and magic marker. That's not, it's not how you talk. Anyway, magic marker. I'm just kidding, a dry erase marker. Make sure it's black. Um, this one is called Bullet Flavor. And we're gonna take it and we're gonna take this spatula and we're just gonna hold it right there and Perfect. <laughs> Take this right here and just. Perfect. That could not be more perfect. Now, you're probably saying next thing she's gonna do is put some mascara on. Well, you're wrong because I still have mascara on from last night. So why would I put more on? You're really kind of stupid. That's why you're watching this video. You need tips from me. So why don't you shut up and watch it and just wait till the end and see what I'm gonna do. And don't worry about all this. I don't wanna hear any hate comments. It's gonna look fine. I'm gonna blend it in and it's gonna look fine. Now, I know y'all are saying, your hair just looks picture perfect. Why would you do anything more to change it? And I agree with you, but I have some leftover coconut oil on my hands. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna do like this and just rub it in my hair so my hair looks extra greasy. Uh, polished, that's a better word, polished. Now, you have your classic look just real subtle, you know, you didn't go too crazy with the Expo marker. It's just real subtle. Um, if you're feeling real uh, crazy, 
just really spunky. You want to draw in some little fake freckles. Do like this. There you go. Just make them look real natural so people think they're real. We'll go over the nose like that. Just perfect. Perfect. And this is just some marker I found in, in my kids' lunch box. I don't know why I was in the lunch box. Perfect. Or moles. It could be moles. Just really cute and quirky. Now that you have achieved the perfect classical look, I know y'all are all wondering where I got this adorable top. I actually got this down um, at the Barrel House Tavern on Highway 90. So you're going to go on down to Barrel House Tavern. Um, you're going to stop by the Oaks first and get you a, a chili cheese dog. And then you're going to go to the, the Barrel House Tavern. You're going to get you some shrimp there because they're really good. Then you're going to ask them for this adorable muscle tank um the color is smoke field bar gray anyway this has been my makeup tutorial and my style expertise since everyone has been asking about it please subscribe <laughs>